you know, all week we talked about that with the start of conference play, uh, it's a battle each and every night out, uh, each and every possession. Nobody goes away, and uh, the competitive level really steps up. And I thought that was very evident in tonight's game. One of the things that as coaches we always remember is that Kayla and Caitlin have been through this scenario. Everyone else out there on the floor to finish the game, it's new to them. Uh, we're asking Jordan Sibrel to make plays down the stretch. Uh, Markel is getting her first time to really be the person counted on. Uh, Fallon Lewis is no longer substituting. And so I was very pleased with the composure they had. But once again, we talk about just that four minute segment. And uh, you know, don't worry about where we're at. Just let's just take care of the business at hand. And I thought we were able to do that. And then the job defensively that Caitlin Maletto did. Uh, Sharp's a tremendous player. And you cannot back off one second when she's out on the floor. And I thought Caitlin was able to do that tonight. We fight. Um, and we pull together and we fight together. And so I think that's the biggest thing is we, we pull together as a cowgirl basketball team and we do it together is the, is the biggest word. Um, our toughness shows because we can all, you know, pick each other up and say, let's go, let's do this. And we all just come together and get the job done. Um, I think so. I mean, all we, we worked on in practice was like, it's pretty much like a switching defense with her standing in the middle. So we had to change up our cuts, but I think we did a really good job with that. Well, yeah, you know, we lost there or won there by one. And, you know, we knew it was going to be a battle. And, you know, being the first conference game, you know, everyone thinks, you know, it's a clean slate. And, you know, we just came out and played how we play. And we had to have some toughness right there at the end. They are special. Uh, they're, they're special players. Because to be able to get 1,000 points, uh, you have to be very consistent. And to be able to do it, what I say, in two and a half years, uh, that just shows how many times she's showing up each and every night with the other team knowing that we have to stop you. I don't know, it was, it's really cool and you know, couldn't do it without these guys, you know, they passed me the ball. So I don't know, it, it was pretty cool to spend it with these guys too.